All right, what's going on everyone? How is it going? My name is Anglitches, and in today's video, I have a really crazy but very realistic video for you guys that can actually help you for future references. You guys are like, what the fuck? That was this is such a random upload. I know, it's a random upload. But I'm, I've been getting a lot of DMs on Instagram of like, some of you guys just asking me like advice because you guys seen uh, the video with me and my ex and you were like, I want something like that. Or I want something like, I, I want something with a girl, like, you know what I mean? And you guys are just like DMing me, what should I do? How should I talk to this person and all this? So in today's video, I'm here to cover all that. And for, I know I have a bunch of girls that actually watch me as well. So if you hear anything like um that, if I've offended you in any way, I'm sorry. I really don't mean it. I'm just putting it out like how, like the easiest way possible that I could say it. And if you've been offended, I'm really sorry. But yeah, so um, I'm just going to cover a few things. What you guys should do on how to make a girl like you. Or the girl you already like, like you more. Or like you back. Or like how to ask a girl out that already likes you. And like, you know, you guys get the point. Basically, make the girl like you. Now, the first thing I would say is, all right, you guys are going to think this is a shocker. But don't chase the girl. You guys are like, dude, I literally clicked the video or I cl I clicked this video for future references or I just clicked this video because I needed advice. And this guy's over here with this headset on telling me don't chase the girl. But I like the girl. Obviously, I'm going to chase her. Well, I know that, guys. What I mean by that is like just don't. Girls tend to like guys that are not really like into them. But at the same time, they're into them. Meaning you show interest in them, but at the same time, you're just like, yeah, it doesn't really matter if we can't be together. Cause if you do that, that's just gonna, it's like, you're asking, you're asking for it, bro. You're like, the girl's gonna be instantly attracted to you. Like not instant, but it's obviously gonna take time. But if you do follow through with that, girl's gonna like you a lot oh uh, okay if you be like you want to hang out she goes um yeah i have to do homework or some, some some bs and then you should just be like yeah that's cool it's fine and then that's about it that's you acting at the same time you showed interest by asking her you want to hang out but if she says anything like um yeah i don't know if i can blah 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 just don't completely say come on please please let's hang out but don't say that no just simply say all right um maybe another time or, or something like that so you're showing like you care and at the same time you're like all right if she says no it's, it's whatever you know that's number one number two girls are usually emotional now a lot of guys could be emotional as well but girls are usually tend to be more emotional and more like more open with emotions than they are or than guys actually are so what i do recommend is like letting the girl you know that you're actually there for her you know if she's hiding her emotions free from you if she's not opening up to you try to make her open up to you like don't force her to be like hey look if you don't do this i'm gonna hang up or like if you're on the phone with her or facetime or some shit or if like it's in person be like okay you don't want to tell me okay fine don't tell me no don't <laughs> slowly get to it if she like simply doesn't want to tell you don't don't push her don't push her just wait a little bit and then ask her again like i know that at the same time that sounds like you're pushing her but that's just you have to you know if you don't know then you can't really be in her life unless you know what the fuck's going on you know so yeah just show emotion you know if she shows emotion you show emotion as well that's another thing this one oh my god you have to learn this one learn facial expressions or voice tones now with me with my previous relationships i've like i've noticed this a lot and like i just um i'm like a pro at it now if you ask a girl okay let's say um you want to go watch a movie or you want to you want to go to the mall and the girl goes yeah sure okay she says all right then here comes another girl and asks can rebecca come with us too for the for the sake of the scenario i'm just gonna say rebecca you you like this girl but there's also this other girl but you don't really like her like that so you just you be like can rebecca come as well she would tend to be like yeah sure like you would hear in her voice tone you'd be like guys she was disturbed like she just wanted you and her time you know so then i would i think simply you would just know straight off the bat that she doesn't want that girl there and you could just say yeah it's fine you know obviously don't bring another girl because you know i'm just giving this as a scenario don't do this but yeah just you know <clears throat> be more open and you know if, if it's like over the phone listen to her voice tone if it's like like you know like yeah sure like she, she's saying it like that and obviously she's like in she's annoyed if she's saying like yeah sure but if she's saying something like yeah sure no problem like then you, she can come because she's showing like it, it's totally fine but if she goes like yeah sure or like if she says why or something you already know she's gonna be disturbed so don't bring her that's another scenario just learn facial expressions from her face you can straight up tell learn voice tones if something's bothering the girl you can see it in her face so her like study her face that sounds pretty weird but like that guys do that all the time you just have to be like more noticing you know observe observing is the key to everything usually now the fourth thing is over text 
I would say show emojis. Now, a lot of people, it's 50-50. Some people show emojis and girls love it. Some people just don't even show emojis and it's just like, dude, what are you doing? Or the girl just doesn't show emojis. She's like, oh my God, this is going to shit. Guys love it when, you know, you show emojis. Girls love it when you show emojis. And honestly, like, I, I was like in this um state where um, this girl kept saying, like, why are you putting red hearts? Like, she was telling me what red hearts means. And I'm just sitting here like, I know what it means. I, I don't tend to discriminate against heart colors, but apparently this like red means that like, you love the person. Like, yellow means like friendship. I don't even know. Like, I, that's too much, man. But if you guys are into that, then I would just like put like a yellow heart at first. Till you actually know that the girl likes you. <sighs> Number five, let the girl actually know that you're there for her. So... If it's like, if she's in a bad situation, let's say she has a best friend and some bad, some shit goes down with her in her best friend. Be there for her. Ask her what's wrong. Ask her a lot of questions. Just be like, hey, so what happened between you and whatever the girl's name is? And just like, make up like, this is just for the scenario. Okay, listen. What happened between you and Mikhail? Be like, yeah, it was just some shit went down, blah, blah, blah. Then you should just be like, tell me about it. I'm I like, I have nothing better to do like just let her know that you're there you know and just try to slowly make her talk and the minute you make her talk listen to every single word well not every single word just listen to the main points so you guys could come back to it if she asks if girls love it that's the number one thing they love is when a guy remembers what they said previously girls love that they can't like they love guys that just listen you know just make sure that you're showing her that you're there for her never okay this is to prevent rejection all right this is way before you even like the girl never tell the girl you like her now that's a, a personal preference of mine but i mean obviously you can because this is how i do it all right if in order to prevent rejection like if you're scared of being rejected obviously a lot of people are like oh you wouldn't want to ask a girl out if you already didn't know she was going to say no why would you ask her out you know so what i would do is just talk to her for a little bit ask her simple questions like hey you got a boyfriend she says no hey so um what do you like to do you know listen to all these little details because that's going to help you out in a bunch ask her about her previous relationships and why it ended so maybe like let's say um let's say tom tom was dating michaela okay so I'm asking Michaela, I'm like, hey, so how, how did you and Tom break up? She goes, oh, I don't know, some shit went, like, you know, some shit happened. And I'm like, what kind of shit? Like, like, what didn't you like about him? She tells you all these little points like, listen, when he's in a big, large group with a bunch of people, he just didn't act the same. Just take note of that because that's the way you're going to get into her life. Number two, it's like, um, I'm buying food. So he always made her pay. Now obviously it should be the guy doing it you know obviously but if, if she says the guy she that she didn't like that she always had to pay you should pay she's gonna like that bomb this this is just for the sake of the scenario I'm like a situation you know make up for all the things that the that her ex didn't so all the things that her ex didn't do and she wanted him to do you should do it because that's what's gonna make her like you and also um never admit to her liking her until you make her admit that she likes you so make her think that you like her at first this is what i usually do then like try to push it a little bit and try to bring it to like this situation where who you like and like stuff like that and you know just try to make her admit it first because if she says all right like let's say i'm zach obviously right she says yeah i like tom you could just easily brush it off like oh okay you and tom all right that prevents rejection number two if she says she likes you then you can you can it's totally fine to admit to her like yeah i, I kind of have a thing for you too you know because if she tells you or she likes you and you tell her that you like her like there's nothing keeping you guys apart now or if she tells you she likes Tom and then or first if you say I like you but then she like she brushes off and like pushes the conversation to a different topic or something she obviously doesn't like you or she's just like nervous but I, I would recommend just try to make her admit that's my personal preference you guys don't have to do that but yeah another one ask a lot of questions girls love it when you guys ask questions and <laughs> try not to talk as much let the girl do the talking and you do the listening and the thinking all right now this this is a big topic in the scenario grooming you got guys <laughs> oh my god i can't stress this enough i had this one guy I don't, i'm not gonna say who I, I have this one kid that messaged me and he was asking me how he should dress and like like grooming wise and all kind of hair like his hair was like my dude's hair was like fucking two foot long like if you guys have two foot long hair girls are usually not into that by I me mean, there are some girls that are into that but usually they're not into that so what i recommend for that is like getting a nice haircut so what i personally do is like home overs like a lot of like northern states in the in the u.s like um new york which i obviously live in new york pennsylvania girls tend to like guys with comb overs or like guys like with like short hair shorter hair so just don't make it too like you know like you don't want to be looking like the the girl from the ring you know 
and you don't want to be looking like a little girl take care of your face take care of your eyebrows take care of everything just you don't want to you don't want to look like you fucking smell honestly like a girl wouldn't want to be around you if you so what i do recommend is grooming obviously take care of your face you know use face wash get rid of your acne get rid of your pimples or whatever and yeah you should be gucci man <laughs> also take care of your body guys go to the gym if you guys are like okay i'm not saying this as like a bad way if you guys are skinny like really skinny or if you guys are really fat hit the gym if you guys are not hitting the gym if you guys are really skinny like i personally dealt with being really skinny in the past obviously and uh, i started hitting the gym and look i started getting some gains yeah but i, I obviously still am skinny but like i'm like lean does that make sense so um being like if you're letting the girl know they actually go to the gym you're being fit the girl would be instantly more attracted to you because just based on the fact that you're taking care of yourself you know and yeah also oh my god i can't stress this enough please use cologne please like please just a girl wouldn't want to be around okay you could be looking like fucking zach efron okay you could be looking like the cutest guy no homo obviously i'm not gay but you could be looking like the the most attractivest dude and the girls like can't resist you oh if you smell like shit if you smell like someone that just came out of fucking trash can that girl's going the opposite way you're going from like an eight or a nine and you're bumping down your points to like from an eight or a nine to like a fucking five or a six and that's disgusting obviously it's just it's just disgusting you know take care of yourself use cologne you know use deodorant like there's some dudes that be smelling like shit in my class oh my god just use deodorant use cologne smell the best because one thing that girls love is when a guy smells really nice because they can't they, they just can't resist it you know the smell it's a scent it's like human nature they just like people that smell very nice last but not least guys clothing now i'll do a whole different subject if you guys if you guys want me to do like a video of clothing like what kind of clothes you should wear and etc you guys could uh just comment that down below and i'll do it but i'm just gonna make it really quick for clothing for clothing dude you gotta look the flyest you can you, you don't want to be looking like someone just puts on a t-shirt wears pajamas and just walks to school like hey everybody hey hey you no know, <laughs> no girls like it when guys know how to dress that instantly if, you, if you're like average looking or if you're kind of ugly or some shit i'm not trying to offend you or anything i'm just saying in general that would like boost up your your points a lot like just know how to dress you know just don't just wear a t-shirt obviously match it with clothes like let's say if it gets like winter time buy some nice hoodies buy a bomber jacket you know i'll do a whole video on clothing if you guys really want me to and i'll actually use my vlogging camera for that i'll show you some like nice outfits but if you guys really like want to impress a girl <laughs> know how to dress just like you know wear some nice like joggers jeans wear some nice shoes like jordans um you know if you guys have a budget obviously like for me i have yeezys obviously because i had money at the time i bought yeezys and you know, everyone knows what yeezys are you know it's the hype but if you guys are on a budget obviously not everyone can buy yeezys and at some point i couldn't buy yeezys as well you know i just <laughs> so just like stick with adidas stick with nike they're not too expensive but they do cost a bit but not too expensive you know stick to a known brand not something really really known that like we're like some kanye shit obviously it's mad money but if you want to save if you guys are on a budget you guys don't have a lot of money do that and girls will love you instantly also the hair like i've said obviously take care of your hair girls love hair by hair i meant like haircuts like a nice haircut anyways it helps it helps i was i i didn't have anyone talking to me like this i never you know i had to learn all this on my own and that was really sad i wish i had somebody you know telling me helping me so if you guys have any issues any problems anything you guys need any help let me know dm me and i will reply as soon as i can so yeah that's the end of today's video guys if you guys enjoyed please give this video a big thumbs up if you guys want to help a friend or somebody out share this video right now share it with your friends family anyone that that's having relationship problems or like likes a girl but is too shy and just show them you know if they just try to make their day you know by watching videos like these is actually it's scientifically proven to help you get more of your self-confidence and confidence is the key confidence gets you everything that's all i gotta say man last thing guys please go to the gym because look i used to be really skinny now look yeah <laughs> okay you guys get the point but go to the gym yeah that's basically it and if you guys enjoyed obviously leave a like blah 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 with that being said guys catch you guys in the next one doses